Paul, tonight, the big question here in the Queen City, could the same thing happen here in the Charlotte area? And are businesses preparing? Fox 46 Northeast Bureau Chief Sidney Heiberger is live in the South End to answer those questions for us. And Sydney, what are business owners saying tonight? Hey, Alicia and Brian, obviously Mecklenburg County has not announced any tighter uh, restrictions than we're currently experiencing. But a lot of local business owners tonight have told me they wouldn't be surprised if those are coming. It's been in the back of their minds for a while now. But they say this time around, if those restrictions do come, at least now, they'll have had some practice. On the outside of most Charlotte businesses, you'll find signs like these, but on the insides, not so much. They started with if you had the vaccine, you didn't have to wear it. Now they're telling us everybody has to wear it. So that's kind of a little bit frustrating. The Mecklenburg County mask mandate is still in effect, but you won't find many people enforcing it. Now that Omicron is starting to spread like wildfire, Business owners have a feeling things will soon start to change. You'll see that there's a lot of to-go orders. You know, everybody's staying home. People are trying to stay safe. You know, we don't have a lot of dine-in orders like we used to. But it's not just masking businesses are concerned about. It's another shutdown, the kind that forced hundreds of thousands of businesses nationwide to close their doors for good. It's always in the back of our minds. Um, I, I think we just hope, you know, it's that kind of season right now that it won't get to that point. At the Waterman Fish Bar, employees who received the first two doses of the vaccine were given a $50 incentive. With the new variants looming, they're wondering if it's time to discuss a similar program for the booster shot. We're usually pretty busy the, first, the two days before Christmas Eve. Uh, we'll really be able to tell in the next two days if it's really affecting us. More than a year and a half since the nation last shut down. Now a Christmas wish that we won't have to do it again. Yeah, the manager at the Waterman tonight told me they just had to cancel their Christmas party due to the Omicron variant. That's now the second year in a row they've had to cancel that holiday party. I'm sure there's a lot of businesses out there who are going to have to do the same thing. I'm live in Uptown, Sydney Heiberger, Fox 46. A lot of anxious business owners. All right, Sydney, thank you.